Today, I'll give a short presentation on the fully internally motorized uh, robotic system for single incision surgical uh, minimal invasive invasive surgery, which is developed in the uh, Hong Kong Polytechnic University Department of Industrial and Systems Engineering under the leadership of Professor uh, Yong, who is the associate head of the department. First, the system is using a straight uh, surgical uh, instrument of robotic arm, like the ordinary laparoscopic instruments. So multiple incisions on the patient is required to achieve proper triangulation of all the instruments uh, in assessing a single surgical site. Therefore, we need a new engineering approach in uh, achieving a single incision, relatively safe, minimal footprint, nose capable surgical robotic system. And then the robotics arm and the 3D cameras are inserted through the cannula into the patient's body. On the abdomin abdominal wall, we make an incision and then insert the sieve. So um, the intern inside of the human body can be assessed. And then we use the cannula, insert through the sieve, as, which acts as a guide. And then we can insert the camera through the, through the cannula. And then the robotics arm is also inserted through the cannula and mounted on the side of it. Internally motorized uh, robot is in the uh, Internal, internally motorized uh, robotic arms. We have embedded all control electronics, motors, and gear chains inside the robotic arms. The robotic arms is controlled through a robust uh, networked control system, and uh, therefore it minimizes all the electrical and mechanical linkage between the robotic arm and the external world. The robotics arm is in its default configuration, it's approximately a straight rod. So we can easily insert the, uh, each robotic arm in sequence um, through the cannula. Uh, 